Hi all, hope you all are doing extremely well. So as you all must be knowing that I have started a Java interview series on my YouTube channel. So here is the third video in the same series. So today's question is checked versus unchecked exceptions. So I am sure most of the time if you have attended the interview where you have specified Java as one of your key skills, this question is most probable probably is supposed to be asked right what is the difference between checked versus unchecked exception so we are going to discuss about this we'll be exploring the concept and all these stuff but it's a humble request from my side that before proceeding further make sure to subscribe my channel if you haven't subscribed till now also do join our telegram community as well we do have multiple members there or definitely you can have a discussion with them related placement queries and all those things so make sure to join so yeah that's all from my side i hope that you must have subscribed the channel so let's proceed further so checked versus unchecked exception what are those before proceeding further let me tell you like when exceptions are caught always remember exceptions are caught they do occur at runtime okay never say that like checked are that occur like you know that are caught at compile time or any any kind of definition if you are having in your mind so let me tell you exceptions always occur at runtime okay so now what are the checked ex uh, exceptions that you can say the exceptions that are checked by the compiler at the compiler for the for making sure that when you are running your program so mm -hmm. to make the execution of your program smooth right at the runtime itself this exceptions are checked by the compiler let's say you are trying to open a file okay you are trying to open a file now for opening a file the possible scenarios can be that this file does not exist does not exist and this can happen frequently this scenario can happen frequently so what will happen to make sure to make sure that this kind of scenario does not occur to handle this compiler will make sure to check this thing so for this what compiler will request you either you have to put your block of the piece of code where you're trying to you know access a file in try catch or you have to throw the exception for the same right or you have to use the throws keyword to handle the unexpected exception right because mostly the chances are mostly the chances of exception being occur you know are very high in this kind of scenario so in short again if i have to explain the definition for you then what you can say is that the exceptions that are checked by the compiler for smooth execution of the program at the runtime is known as checked exception right the chances of the exceptions for which to occur are very high for example when you are going to attend an exam when you are going to attend an exam what you always make sure that you do have your admit card with you will check it again and again right because the chances are very high and if this thing happened you won't be allowed to sit in the exam will they allow you no definitely not that's why we are very cautious about our exam we do make sure whatever resources are needed uh maybe pen pencil or whatever is needed we do check it again and again okay this thing should be with us even uh even your mother your father will be checking out whether you have keep this or not whether this is available to you or not right but on the other hand uh on the other hand there are certain other things other possibility as well you know that can happen any mashup that can happen right when you're going to attend the exam or anything so the chances for these bad things to happen are very rare to happen any accident or all these things these are very rare so you are not going to check for them you are not going to very worry about them your parents are not going to be very worry about them but about your pen pencil admit card they are going to be worried right so you are going to check them again and again so the chances of the those kind of exception which are very frequent to occur they will they will come under checked exception and those exceptions that will rarely occur that will come under unchecked exception so rarely occurring exceptions are not checked by the compiler because as i mentioned they are rarely occurring for example arithmetic exception arithmetic like as if you are doing 23 divided by 0 so this won't be checked this won't be handled this won't be checked by the compiler compiler has no issue with that because the chances of these kind of uh, you know exceptions to hug occur is very rare right so this will come under unchecked exception now you must be knowing that first of all we have a throwable class from which we do have errors errors and exceptions errors and exceptions now in exceptions what do we have runtime exception 
run time exception right and uh, we have io exception we have io exception so in run time we can have a you know a null pointer exception index out of bound exception or in checked exception we can have input output exception or class not found or any such kind of exception right so errors errors and runtime exception errors and runtime exceptions are what they are unchecked they are unchecked exception whereas this io exception that i just that i just discussed io exception are what checked exception right io exception are what checked exception okay so in short we can say exceptional handling in exceptional handling what three things are playing major role first of all checked exception unchecked exception error right okay so now you must have got a proper sort of idea like what is the difference between checked and unchecked exception let me show you an example as well for what we just discussed right now so let's move to the example part now so here you can see what we are trying to do is uh, we are using file input stream here right now you can see there is some error let's explore what the error is so you can see we are getting unhandled exception type file not found exception so as i've told that uh, io exception is what that is checked exception so compiler will make sure that you are handling that exception so that's why we are getting the error it won't compile right on the compile time itself we are supposed to get the error so you can see we are getting two fixes here either you have to add throws declaration or you have to surround this piece of code with the try catch so if i'm i'll be adding this throws declaration throws file not found exception so you can see the error has been gone right so that's what check exception is now if in case i'm doing let me remove this okay and uh, let's move this part as well let's say if i'm doing int a equal to 12 divided by 0 right so you can see this is also what arithmetic exception should be thrown but this is as if this is what unchecked one so that's why we are not getting any error let's uh, run our code as well right so let's run it so you can see error has been thrown but compiler didn't check for this one because it is very rarely occurring it is very rarely occurring exception right it is very rarely occurring exception so this is what unchecked but arithmetic exceptions are what unchecked exceptions right so i hope that by now you must have understood about checked versus unchecked exception so that's it from this video thank you for watching this video guys i'm going to make more such video further in this series so make sure to subscribe my channel bye bye